She's standing at the halfway point, looking out, but no soul in sight. Wondering if I set myself on fire, would they know that my love burns bright? Looking down at her trembling knee, she sees the weights, burdens of brick and stone. Before she buckles, she strengthens her shoulders and she prays she's not alone, but alone she is. Can't stop the tears as they trickle down from her eyes to her cheeks, her neck. She's given her everything and despite her courage, she doesn't know what she's saved from the wreck. Tattered dreams, broken ambitions, everything's distorted, no escape from the bitterness of blame. Curdled nightmares of monotony in a cruel world that's savage, even her face doesn't look the same. All this for nothing, she cries. Do you even have peace of mind in your home, in your kitchen, in your bed? How could you leave me behind? No betrayal of this kind. What the fuck is going on in your head? Her body can feel it, she's wiped, her spirit's done Her knuckles grip as her feet start to follow the well-known path back to square one She returns to the place, enters her time and space Where suffering lives floor to ceiling Her breath burns and her lungs crackle, spine aches As she begins to sit with this feeling This too shall pass, this too shall pass, this too, this too She gasps, attempting acceptance Straddling spirit and diagnoses on her knees She cries out, please, some kind of repentance she beats her chest one breath let's go of expectations head bow she feels those once distant now all encompassing vibrations admission of how little her desire for living she was struck by a lightning bolt her own story played before her and brighter than ever she saw it was never her fault suddenly she saw everything she'd endured the violence the shame the injustice she drove to the heart of it and it hurt even harder but so little was driven by malice Fearful the day, championed by ignorance, speed, complacency and negligence Fatally flawed systems thriving, but how to tackle the incompetency's dominance She begged for an overturning, fix this, set it right, set it right, I can't take this anymore But in the silence, she knew that things were as they are Something stirred in her core A light had sparked what she didn't know, but just as she went to rise up not so far, said the voice, we've another task. Tell me, what's in your cup? She knew the riddle, changed the way you look at things, think positively, declared correctly, my cup's half full. But it occurred to her that what with all she was carrying, she didn't know where her cup was at all. Bringing to a surface so worried at the state of the world that I've been failing and looking after myself. I felt so far from being enough that I've sought wholeness in food, sex and booze, the idea of wealth. I've been listening to the whispers that tell me if I buy just one more thing or make myself thin, then I'll finally feel like I've made it. I'll be happy. People will love me and welcome me in. Treated life like a game, one where if I just achieve this, I'll be relaxed at the next checkpoint. I lost my attitude, lost my gratitude, looked at the world as though it was something to exploit. I got addicted to acting fingers, political figures, thinking I was right and possessed some kind of moral high ground. All the while, my own behaviors, beliefs, and actions of breeding a desire for a life that will never be found. I didn't notice the plastic wrapping, toxic menu. I lived in my head instead of my home. I know nothing about the supply chain of people affected by my hungry demand as it's grown. In the West, I'm blessed, and although pain is no contest, it's fair to say it's not been an easy run. But this privilege is a tool, and I need to own my shit, not get distracted till justice is won. Mm -hmm. 